私には父を探すって目的があるからあとはついでよいいわね父から受け継いだ技よ Hi everyone, this is Kroneko. I'm going to talk about this Kuraju or Courage. And then she has the recently adjustment plus muscle ability from her story right now. And then she suddenly become one of the top fire shooter attacker. As you can see, the dex is more than 1.4k. It's a bit high actually, and the speed is more than 200. Interesting. And the physical attack is so so, but the dex is high, it's good enough. And the HP is about this. And then about the leader skill. This is one of the best leader skill for the shooting attacker for a fire unit. Because as a 4 star unit, for some reason shooting attack plus 30% and all attack plus 20%. So total is 50% on the shooting unit. So it's actually quite high. And then about the main ability. Well, there are some minor changes in the main ability. And the first thing is. The second skill from the 5th gate upgrade, it added extra this shooting resistance down can be stacked 2 times. So basically, this is also one of the best shooting resistance down debuff right now. Even though it's a single target, but it's the best. And you can use 5 times. And then, second adjustment is from the third skill, the parallel status instead of 50% become 100%. So basically, other than the immune to the parallel status, is very good, especially for PBB. And then the last adjustment for the main ability is the last skill. This song versus a win, it further increases the power. Instead of 50, become 120. So this skill is very good against a win plus machine. And then lastly is from the side ability. This first skill, it removes the casting time. So this attack skill is an instant cast. So it's quite good. And then this is a muscle ability. It increases her dex, speed, and shooting range plus 3. So that her shooting range is actually quite far. It's 3 plus 5. Yeah, so it's really very far. And then if you animate the side ability of this skill for the one turn, shooting range plus 3, so become plus 11. <laughs> and then this is a gear. There's a minor adjustment on the status from her mementos. It further increases the physical attack and dex, so that the overall status for the attack is increased. As well as the weapon ability is very good, but there is no adjustment. It permanently increases the physical attack, dex, and accuracy, and can be stacked 5 times when she attacks any enemy. And then for the next gear, this accessory you can get from the Christmas Ikona Mementos. Well, it is also very good for her because it increases the shooting range plus 1. And then with the medicine jewel and charm status attack and accuracy. So with this accessory, her shooting range will become 12. <laughs> Super far away. And then for another gear is this armor you can get from the Abel Mementos. Well, it increases the maximum HP and initial jewel and jewel gain. So I think this three gear right now is the best for her. But of course you can switch around with the gear. Like for example, you can switch with this one with. This accessory is from the second Abel Mementos from Summer and then it greatly increases her speed and with the blind resistance and stop resistance but she is a fire unit so dark attack is useless but at least it greatly increases her speed. So depending what do you want to do with her. And then for the passive, you can switch around with booster like for example with shooting attack up and maybe with the long snipe further increase the shooting range or maybe overdrive yeah either way but I think best will be the booster plus 2 so that the speed is so high and then this is a uh, rules of sales well I equipping her with physical attack and single attack up so basically anything that is increased the physical attack or uh, accuracy or uh, maybe area attack up will be good for her and then for the MB slot it will be good for dex and shooting attack as well as this one is a dex yeah, and anything else. And then this is, I'm going to try out at the training arena. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's check her status first. I'm using her leader skill, so there's no increase on physical attack or dex, but it increased the HP and the shooting attack and the all attack. So the overall damage should be extra 
And then the speed is about 213, it's super high And the shooting attack is triple arrow Okay, this is a normal attack, let's see the damage Okay, about 4k and About 4k as well And how about this skill Okay, 7.5k and 12k, okay, nice And how about this skill About 5k and 7k and then how about this skill 5k and 10k okay very nice and then how about this skill okay not really that bad and 8k and then how about this skill okay with the silent status and it's a hundred percent hit okay next is if the opponent has any bad status Let's see this skill damage increase by how much Okay, let's go Okay, let's see the damage increase by how much Oh, near 7k And near 9k, not bad Okay, next is I'm going to use this skill Increase her dex and shooting range But reduce her movement So let's see the overall damage increase by how much for the one turn Okay, let's go Okay, let's see her status first Well, the dash is about 2k plus a bit So it's not that bad But her movement will be 1 So beware for 1 turn And then let's see the normal attack first Okay, about 5k and Near 6k And then how about this skill Near 10k And 16k, okay And how about this skill About 9k and 12k and then how about this skill about 6k and then on the weakness okay 13k not bad and then how about this skill near 7.5k and 10k okay okay lastly is I'm going to use this skill to reduce the opponent's shooting resistance for 2 times And also when she attacks the enemy for 5 times Let's see the overall damage increase by how much Okay, let's go Okay, let's check her status first Well, the physical attack and the death is about this high Okay And then let's see the normal attack damage how much Ooh, 12k and 13k, okay And how about this skill Ooh, 23k 38k, okay How about this skill? 21k and 27k, okay And then how about this skill? 15k and Ooh, 30k, okay, quite nice And how about this skill? About 17k and 24k, okay, very nice so conclusion is She suddenly become very powerful As a fire attacker Some more she is a 4 star And then her weapon is also very good And the mementos is not a uh, limited mementos as well And second thing is She is quite good in raid boss, hell quest and arena and pvp All of them And then she is also one of the super long range shooter and her shooting range may as good as Su Yi or Ryu Yi, those creator who has very long shooting range. But Su Yi and Ryu Yi is a limited unit. So compared to them, she's really very easy to train. As well as you just need to get the mementos and that's it. So I guess that's all about Cry Rage. Thank you for watching this video. If you guys got any questions about her, please comment. Please touch like and subscribe if you like this video. See ya, Selnara.
誰でも同じでしょうけれど。